Hey, we're Kid Prov and we do improvisational comedy. And what we do is connect that improvisational comedy to your curriculum, math, language arts, even character education, all for you. Right now we're gonna put on a story problem for you right in front of you. You don't have to read anything, you just have to follow along. But before I do that, I need a couple of actors. I'm looking for a way to, to bring theater into math, which is, can be difficult. Um, that was one of our major goals, and so with Story Problem Live, what we did then is we started off with just us as the actors. All right, this is what's going to happen. Bob is going to be the main character in our Story Problem. In the bag, he is going to have a certain number of items. During the Story Problem, the characters are going to come from backstage, and they're going to give Bob items to put in the bag, and they're going to take out items from the bag. Now, the thing is, your job is to keep track of how many items are continually in the bag, because at the end, I'm going to say how many items, and you have to be right on top of it. Now the thing about it is we're going to try to mess with you as much as possible. Want a hot dog? Oh. <laughs> Hello hot dog devil. When we got kids up there it, we have to direct them. Uh, we have to you know get behind uh, the scrim and we have to say okay this is you know, this is what's happening here, this is what you need to do, but you get to choose the character, just make sure that you go out there and you either give something to the main character or take something away. Well, hello, Fluffy. I'm your Fluffy. It's a laughless monkey. You know, I think that kind of goes with what I found in the drain last week. Hey, now. It's a laughless chicken. We really never put aside what's important. Everything that we address in Kid Prov is still going to be on that test. And it's just that we do it with this play and with this humor in a way that hopefully transcends the seriousness of it and yet never lets go of it. All right, here we go. All right, let's count it out with Bob. Here we go. <laughs> One, two, We do have the data that shows that our students are performing at a mastery level and our goal on our campus is to increase our commended performance so KidProv can only enhance that, which it does. Our commended scores continue to increase every year and we have had KidProv the last two years so I think that's a direct benefit for it. 